расстрелянных. We will not forgive the destroyed houses. We will not forgive the missile that our air defense shot down over Okhmadyet today. And more than 500 other such missiles that hit our land, all over Ukraine, hit our people and children. We will not forgive the shooting of unarmed people, destruction of our infrastructure. We will not forgive. Hundreds and thousands of victims, thousands and thousands suffering. And God will not forgive. Not today, not tomorrow, never. And instead of forgiveness, there will be a day of judgment. It seems everything Russian servicemen have already done is still not enough for them. Not enough ruined destinies, mutilated lives. They want to kill even more. Tomorrow, Russia has officially announced the shelling of our territory, our enterprises, defense complex. Most were built decades ago by the Soviet government, built in cities. And now they are in the middle of an ordinary urban environment. Thousands of people work there. Hundreds of thousands live nearby. This is murder deliberate murder. And I have not heard a reaction from any world leader today, from any Western politician, reaction to this announcement. The audacity of the aggressor is a clear signal to the West that sanctions against Russia are not enough, because they didn't understand, did not feel, they did not see that the world is really determined, really determined to stop this war. You will not hide from this reality. You will not hide from new murders in Ukraine.